Now, right on the heels of its 20th anniversary, the Wisconsin Department of Transportation Steered and Clear Law is more relevant than ever. DOT's data shows laws like this are more likely to save time as well as lives. Unfortunately, accidents happen. Wisconsin State Patrol and the Department of Transportation found for every one minute of interstate lane blockage because of a crash, there will be at least a four minute delay in traffic. While many of you were taught to stay put after a crash, State Patrol Lieutenant Nathan Clark says that's not the case anymore. You have to steer it and clear it. If you have a crash and it is a property damage only, take the vehicles from the traffic lanes and move them over to the distress lane. DOT found vehicles sitting in traffic are 25% more likely to cause another traffic incident. Cars involved in second crashes have an 18% chance of being fatal. They want things out of the road as quickly as possible because we know the danger is high. Tow truck operator Mark Salentine agrees it's important to try and get away from moving traffic because sometimes being on the shoulder isn't enough. A fellow driver was almost hit doing his job. He's moving his flatbed to a line to pick up the damaged vehicle and somebody comes around the corner too fast. The U.S. Department of Labor found transportation to be the second most deadly industry with more than 900 deaths. We're losing roughly one tow operator per week is being killed. Clark says the safest place is a crash investigation site. There are more than 20 across Wisconsin's southeastern interstate. So we don't have that gapers block on both sides of the highway and takes it to a very safe location that the investigating officer can get over to. Now, law enforcement says another reason drivers must steer it and clear it, crashes cause a significant financial burden on the city. Traffic jams hold up millions of dollars in commercial motor vehicles and keep various company employees from doing their jobs.